hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is a ts tech talks video on today's video guys i'm going to show you how to do more awesome things with your kind master test option now um kind master allows you to animate your test while editing your video so under the video editing section you can make use of a lot of different test option and i'm going to show you guys how the test animation works on your kind master now let's dive into that all right, so I have KindMaster open. The first thing you need to do is to click on create new. And now leave this aspect ratio on default because that is what I usually use to create video editing. So um, the first thing I need to do is to click on the video area, click on where I have the video. Now I just tapped on the video and I have it on my scene. You can notice on the timeline area. So then again, I need to close this to um, start editing my video. So to add a test, all you need to do is to click on this layer section on the right hand area or left hand area of the screen. Click on the layer and you can notice where it has test, right? Now click on the test to go ahead and type whichever test you want. I'm going to type TS Tech Talk. Oh, not test. Talk. And then click OK to confirm my writing. And you notice this arrow. Um, arrow that is up facing up and down go ahead and drag that to make it bigger and then once you've done that go ahead and click on this test area to choose the font you want and then close it off once you confirmed it go ahead and change the color by selecting this color section on the top on the right area just after the scissors area on the property section click on that i'm going to make this a red color click on this check icon to confirm you have selected the red color now um the next thing to do you notice where it has um in animation overall animation and out animation now that particular option is actually what i'm going to be explaining now the first option says in animation that means the first thing that displays or how the animation is going to play while it's coming in and then the overall animation is actually the animation that keeps playing steadily while the video plays on and then the out animation is the animation that displays on the test while um, the test is getting to the ending of the timeline now the first thing we are going to add is in animation let me show you guys how it works so i'm going to go ahead and add in this fade in confirm it and now um play the video um this keep displaying you notice it right let me scroll up play it again oh do not display again notice the test the way it fades in right now let me go ahead and add out animation now click on the out animation and click on fade the same thing and then confirm now play the video you notice the way it plays and then watch you notice the way it goes out now it plays that way and goes out this other way just because it is the in and the out animation now let me go ahead and add a test without um the out animation i'm going to make this bigger reduce it in the bottom change the color to um this purple color because of the sand and now i'm going to go ahead and add in animation so i'm going to say fade and confirm it and play it watch it fades right now watch at the ending now at the ending nothing happens right now let me go ahead and add even one more <laughs> layer test and life but click ok increase that change the color since it's going to be on top i'm going to give this color you know what i'm going to choose a yellow color and then i'm going to add a background to the test click on the i just closed that out um you notice where it um it has background color just scroll down to this bottom area you notice where it has background color right go ahead and tap on that enable the background color click on this um um the one that has zero zero click on the icon next to it and then i'm going to make this which color did i want to choose then this color and then um when i click on confirm you will notice there is nothing much you won't notice the different the reason why you didn't notice the different right there is because the color is transparent and also that blue color is not cool so i'm going to change that blue color to at least a green color 
I think that is fair, but it's still not displaying well. The reason why it's not displaying properly is because um, the opacity has been reduced. So when you click right there, you notice the opacity um, below this area. It has 50 opacity. Now go ahead and slide it to 100%. So the opacity is now 100%. Click on the check and you can notice it displays properly. But then again, the test is still not showing properly. So I'm going to edit that even further by changing the color to black and confirming it. And I think this appears is better so now let's go ahead and choose our animation which is going to be overall animation so um choose anyone you think is cool to you i think i think this pause is okay now leave it and play watch you notice the way it pauses right now that is cool right now if i extend this um test to the ending of this video let me say i extended it even further even to the ending of the video this animation is going to keep playing 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 non-stop until the video ends now the reason why it plays non-stop until the video end is because i'm actually using overall animation which means the animation is going to be playing continuously until the end of the video so now let me go ahead and add even more animation and i'm going to make it overall animation this time now you notice i'm always making use of this pathfinder stuff <laughs> that's actually a name i usually use mostly on my gaming so i'm going to change the background color enable it make it black also and increase the opacity then i'm going to change the test color to white the test color not exactly white though so i'm going to put it on top of this area since this one is already in the middle i'm going to have it on top of the area overall animation and i'm going to make it a ring animation now you notice how that rotates right it actually going to be rotating you notice it like in 3d format which is cool right now if i want to drag this to the end of our video i can do that also so i have it to the end of our video also and guys before i round up this video let me show you guys a quick tip now you notice i've been adding the animation so far by clicking on the test and adding all the animation that i want right now i just choose this animation i'm going to reduce i'm going to change the color let's make it black have it right there and put our um I'm not going to put overall animation this time. I want you to notice the difference. Now I'm going to click um, in animation. So I'm going to say slide. So it's going to slide from the right, right? And then um, the out animation also is going to be there. So I'm going to slide to the left also and then click confirm. Now let me play it so that you see. Try to observe. You notice it slides in, right? And then slides out now on that same area on that same area i'm now going to add another one i'm going to add another test i'm going to call this stanley on the same area i want it to be on the same timeline so that you guys see the difference on the same timeline i have it on the same timeline now and then i'm going to add stanley click ok and then i'm going to add the same in animation left but this time around you notice on this bottom area right there um it has a number the first number is 0 0.5 and then the next one is one and then the other one is 1.5 all of this number is actually the time it takes to delay the animation to come in now if you want the animation to delay a little bit before coming into um before coming in all you need to do is to swipe even further now i'm going to make this two right and then i'm going to change the test color so that i'll be able to see what we are doing because right now i'm not able to see that properly so i'm going to put this right there and then i'm going to add the out animation the same thing and then still make it slow and um let's play it it's actually not on the same timeline let me zoom in a little yes it's not on the same timeline so let me play the animation so you get to see it now you notice it takes a longer time for the stanley to enter and then goes away so in any way you are able to get to see the slow time 
uh, on the Stanley and then it slowly fade away. I think the reason is because the time frame is different and the time frame for the trust is faster and the one for the Stanley is a bit slower. So depending on whichever way you want to do your um you want to animate your test, just go around and play with it. Choose the best option you want in animation, out animation, or an animation that plays all through the video. Choose whichever one you want and then I'm sure this video is helpful. Save the video if you're done and that is all for today's video. If you like this video, smash like and subscribe to the channel for more video. I'm going to see you guys on my next video. Peace.